What are you using here for your grade board? So the local guy, um, he coats that with a polyurea. It's just a treated. So um, he sprays them. Okay. Yeah. So we've been using those. Uh, he's up in Varna. Um, we've been using them this year to do all of our skirt board. It's, I don't know, six bucks a foot. It's a bit more. Then doing but a grade guard? Then doing a grade, like guard. Protector grade guard. Yeah. Have you used that in the past? I have just another step. Yeah. I mean, I, I like it. I'm looking for systems yep. that take the thinking out of, because yeah, everybody's awesome. new. Yep. Everybody's know, new. Skilled, and skilled labor's hard. With hard our system, now. we're getting into the non-traditional post frame builder and our system we've designed it to be so intuitive a stick framer can build with it a steel framer can build with it a do-it-yourselfer can build with it sure. and and adding some of these like long term we want to add this to the panel so it will come out of burkholder's factory I'll with, with this stuck on it nice to give just a little more protection. That's a good idea. That um, this is like bed liner. The polyurea yeah. Yeah, is strong. like a bed liner, yeah. 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 Like you said, it takes a step out of the process not having to put a protect, great protector on. Right, right. I like that. So he did, we, we did tongue and groove. Um, he can do smooth four sides. The tongue and groove, you can't stack them. So he does now have them without this coated, the top. Oh, okay. So that, the bottoms, yeah. yeah. We put three runs on a building where you're. But really, you don't. I mean, if you start assembling them on your panels, you wouldn't need tongue and groove. Correct. Right? No. And he just had tongue and groove, so that's what we used. Sure. And I'm like, can't you do smooth four sides? Yeah. He goes, I can paint whatever you want. Yeah. I'm like, okay. <laughs> now you tell me. Yeah. 